guys, Trey here, and you just saw the unboxing of all the pieces of the awesome G6 Max gimbal. This thing is legit. So I've taken my time, made sure that everything worked out before I gave a, a true review, and I couldn't be happier with this thing. So setup was a breeze. Uh, the, if you go to the app store, or not app store, but if you go to their app, and you're just going to click G6, you go through all the tutorials and every single thing is on here of setup, how to balance it, how to do absolutely anything you can imagine, each feature that this thing holds. So the app is where it's at. If you get this, make sure you get the app because you'll be somewhat, I wouldn't say lost, but you will, you will be behind the gap if you don't get the app first, read through it, make sure you know everything, then move to your gimbal because the app will make your life so much easier. Now, let's go on to the gimbal. So the gimbal, I've already balanced it as you can see, but this thing is awesome. Setup and balancing is a breeze after I watch the app because there's a lot of moving parts, but after you, after you read and look how to lock each piece in, move on to the next, and then figure out how to lock it, as you can see I'm doing there, but then as you get everything balanced, like I have, then you can just unlock, check each balance, see? And you can unlock this one, and then check balance there. Look at that. And then this last one here, you're supposed to balance it as so. And you can see, it always goes back to balance. That's the greatest thing about this, even not turned on. So. Let's spin this thing around. As you can see here, you have everything you need. Uh, you've got your LCD screen, which I'll go ahead and turn it on. I don't know if you guys can see that in the video. And it's turned on, it's locked in, everything is tight. You can see my movements are smooth as can be. And I'll pick it up again, and you can see how smooth and beautiful this thing works. So I do have the DJI Osmo Action on here, but this thing will hold an iPhone, it'll hold a small mirrorless camera, anything within the weight range, I don't have that in front of me, it'll do it with no worries. You've got a little bit of clearance, you gotta make sure that it'll do, but after you get that clearance and that weight in there, any mirrorless camera that you have will be flawless. I've been rocking the DJI Osmo on this and chasing my son around. I'll be sure to get some of those videos up because they're pretty fun. The I don't know where I don't know what else to say. So on that, but you can see the motors and everything is just so smooth. This thing is quiet. I don't have any issues, any worries of anything. You can also change the parameters in case it was slightly out of balance when you started. But everything works, and I can, I'm gonna say this again, smooth. I couldn't be happier with, with, the, with the G6 Max. If you are in the market, do not overlook this guy. Oh, another cool feature. So, I, you don't necessarily need it on the uh, DJ Osmo Action, but like I was telling you, your mirrorless, mirrorless cameras and a few other items, you have a port right here in the front. Again, I don't know if you can quite see that. So you have a port here, which actually you connect a handful of cords that are supplied to try to make sure that, that it comes with anything you need. You'll hook up from this port here, you'll hook up to your camera, and then you also have a button right here on the side, right here, for a shutter, or you can start your videos or multiple things from it. It is a dream. They really thought of everything and put it into one gimbal. And I do not think anyone out there will be disappointed in this guy. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below and I'll be happy to answer anything that you can or if I've had hands-on experience with it. If not, I'll test it and see what I can come up with or try to fix your problem or your issue. So be sure, message me below and you guys should jump on this one.